Thunder Valley. Steve, Brady, Rod. Really cool bike. Brandon got it all dialed in. His company's racer edge. Really stoked. Avoiding the sun. Gonna be a good good weekend. Just walked the track and it is pretty um, pretty gnarly. It's super deep. They have it uh, shaped up just like they always do, like technical for the national and I'm excited. Just gonna go ride my best, do what I do. Uh, I've got some experience doing this so I know what to do. Just gotta perform, excited for tomorrow. It's race day, beautiful morning at Thunder Valley Motocross Park. We've got Brady tightening up the tank. The bike on charge. Steve found some coffee. Sure. Looks like it's gonna be a great day. What do you know, dude? The fucking mini donut. The mini donut. Joseph made it. Bright and early too. After a questionable night, he made it. Brady dog. Qualifying went really good. Um, first qualifier, I ended up first in B practice, and that was actually the faster qualifier. Second one, I was uh, second, but the times were slower. So it put me at a, I did a 213 and 25th overall going into the motos. So got 230 plus two minute motos right now, getting ready for moto one, and looking forward to a good set of motos. Stoked. Um, this is the best I ever qualified. So let's go get it done to the motos. What's up? It's uh, Sunday, day after the national. Just want to do a little recap of how the uh, how the day went. Um, very busy yesterday, a lot of people around, so didn't quite get a ton of GoPro footage. Um, so yeah, qualified 25th overall, which is the best I've ever done. Really, really stoked on that. The morning was great. Um, first moto, so go off the line and got caught up in a first uh not even first turn it was up the start hill pile up uh it was me nicoletti uh mitchell falk uh jeremy smith we all watered it up real good and uh I um, banged myself up a little bit, but I broke my front brake lever off, which was a bummer. Had just a little tiny nub to pull in the whole moto. Uh, tipped it over a little bit later on and caught up to 31st overall in that moto. Uh, felt like I rode pretty good considering what I dealt with. 
um going to moto number two um horrible start but uh then five laps in i had caught up to 29th i felt pretty good and riding well and rear end starts slipping around a little bit and i'm like oh no i think we uh i think we got a rear flat and as soon as as soon as the rear goes flat um the front went flat too so i must have hit a big hole or overshot a jump really gnarly and pinched both tires i've never done that in my entire life um but yeah two flats so i couldn't i couldn't finish the moto i couldn't even roll around it uh I, it was dangerous so i was very happy i didn't go down because of it but uh had the dnf moto number two but overall still really good awesome weekend um happy with my riding happy with you know it's just so many people came out to support me and it was just a blast i loved it um i wish that my brother and amanda and their baby daisy could have been there but uh they had they had priorities right now that were more important um other than that it seemed like everyone came out my mom my dad just everyone who supports me was there and uh it was it was an, an awesome time uh you know i live for these moments and i'm just gonna this will be one i remember forever so um we'll see what other rounds we get to this year definitely planning on spring creek millville um who knows maybe we'll get to some more but everything was awesome um dirt bikes are great see you at the next one thank you